Not all overload safety systems are the same. It all comes down to the technology. The main factor is how consistent is the tripping action. This means a gentle shock-free tripping of the plough body combined with easy, vigorous soil re-entry. Lemkin has developed a patented control device for this, the Tandem Overload Safety System. If the plough body hits a stone, it swerves upwards. The point of resistance at which this action is triggered depends on the pre-settings of the double coil spring system or hydraulic ram. If the trip force setting is exceeded, the patented Lemkin system, consisting of tandem beams and spacing roller, uses the spring or hydraulic systems to diminish the force progressively relative to the increase in height. The result is the typically gentle tripping and re-entry action of the Lemkin plough. When the plough body re-enters the soil, however, the force then increases progressively relative to the depth until the plough body is back in its original working position. When a single field encompasses many different types of soil, the Hydrix Hydraulic Overload Safety System truly comes into its own. The trip force is individually preset on the plough's control unit and the tripping action subsequently directly controlled from the cab of the tractor. This allows the trip and re-entry forces to be quickly adapted to the changing soil conditions. Light soils require the trip force to be as low as possible so that the stones remain in the ground. When the soil becomes harder or heavier, the tractor operator increases the pressure with the tractor controls to ensure the plough body is firmly held in the earth, even under such difficult conditions. Making readjustments and monitoring the manometer are no longer necessary. In addition, the high-quality tempered spring steel beams and robust plough legs provide the necessary elasticity for the swerving action. The firm connection between the beam, the frame and the solid leg brackets enable the plough body to always return to its fixed starting position.